Oh, this game's a superstar, but we already know it. One, two, three, bingo. <laughs> Sexton, Hamlet again. And found another gear then, sends a long one home. <laughs> and gets the crowd up on their feet. We might have to actually change my estimation on how many goals you can uh, kick this year. I said 40 plus. He's off to an absolute flyer every four or five minutes. He's got another five possessions and has a shot at goal. And he just seemed to get involved on multiple occasions. And once the good midfielders see that 50 meter arc, they attack it. And that's a beautiful kick. Sprayed a couple in the first turn. Didn't look like missing that one. Great goal. and he was being tackled and now the Suns, they can open it up right through the middle. Hall for Martin, he's got some numbers. The kick long to a one-on-one, -on -one. Dawson out of position, Lynch too strong. He looks to start Todd Lynch, doesn't he? But he's getting a bit of separation from Zach Dawson, which is creating issues for the defender in terms of watching the footy, watching where his man is, getting the right body position. In actual fact, Dawson went back pretty hard there, but he just stood his ground firmly, Tom Lynch, and then reasserted front position to the strong mark. He should kick his fifth. Four goals for the superstar from the Gold Coast Suns. No problems from there, and a handy steadier for the Gold Coast. Well, I just, I just brought the stats up as well. I'm thinking, where's Fremantle trying to get the advantage here? Handball receives it through the roof for Fremantle. Trying to play on, get things going. Uncontested position where they've been down most of the day. They're up in that. But that's where Gold Coast here would please Rodney Ede, the fact that this opportunity going forward, only their third one for this quarter. They get a score to steady. And it's a really important score as well, where, Gold, where Fremantle were coming extremely hard. Keeping it alive for multiple opportunities. Hall to Ablett through the middle. What have they got? To Hall again. The speed was quite brilliant. Kerno couldn't go with him. That was Ed. And oh. Hall just burned him off. Goes out wide. Big opportunity for Day here. Could have gone himself. And very unselfishly to Lynch. And he tried to get the handball through. And that is the Gold Coast Suns. That's how they want to play. Quick link up handballs off half back here. We see Ablett. See that handball that was spot on, didn't it? Yeah, all three of those handballs were perfect. That fast footy through the middle, and that is just a great passage of play. It's exciting play. So here is Lynch at the end of all that with a kick from 15 metres out. Not a lot of angle about it. Goes in and he kicks his second goal. Brilliant start from Gold Coast. Across the face and sound. Should cut it down. Good pick up on the move. No launch from here. Superb. And away. That is Boomer. scintillating. Boomer says give me the hand, boys. <laughs> I'm 38 years of age. Defence of North Melbourne is the chase from uh, Harvey, but will applaud the, the run from Saad. Have a look at him. Both players going he wants flat him, out. Too, he, he wants him, but he's just thinking, any danger of someone coming at me. <laughs> just someone. This might be about to change. Griffin. Again, they reach an impasse to Stephen May. Well, it wasn't a great kick, to be fair, to Jeremy Cameron, but regardless, he's out putting on the clinic out there, Stephen May. Yarlett puts it low. Dash is on out of defence again. Right to the wing to Lynch. He got Tomlinson where he wanted him, and he can kick it for Peter Wright. And this will really sting the Giants. Gee, that's clever play, isn't it? When they get a bit of space, they know what to do. I thought Archie was really good in the build-up there. Good kick to the advantage of Tom Lynch. And he plays on regularly. Yeah. He, he moves well, so he knows he's not going to get run down quickly. And a good left foot kick finds Peter Wright. Unusual to see a Lynch that efficient on the left slipper. <laughs> I can assure you. Very nice pass. So Peter Wright, best kick I've seen over 200 centimetres this man. Straight through the middle, and it's still game on here at Metricon. Nice build up, and his second goal for big Peter Wright. But the, the lead up work was uh, very good, and it, once again, it was Tom Lynch work, working back and taking a good mark against Thompson. Just edged him under the ball, just enough, dropped back off, and then identified that Wright was deep.
All he had to do is get it out in front of Wright because he had too much size and space really for Pete Shaw. He was never going to miss from there.